Um, today, we're going to discuss the understanding of the ecological, ecological problems and types of environmental and their functions. The conservation movement advocates for the preservation of endangered animals as well as the preservation of any ecologically vital natural regions, genetically modified foods, and global warming. As you can see nowadays, ecological has uh, become a bigger issue as we witness our environment uh, becomes weak. Industrialization uh, has, be, has been the biggest source of pollutions. In order to save environment, we should uh, switch to eco-friendly uh, energy sources such as uh, solar power or wind energy, etc. And lots of public places uh, use the safe environment posters and stickers uh, to create awareness among the general public. Environmental problems. Uh, in this picture, you can uh, clearly see that we are the one who killed our environment. Humans have been mis mistreating, mistreated uh, and polluting the ecosystems that nourishes them for many years. However, widespread environment concern may be so overwhel overwhelming that individuals don't know what to do, uh, what to don't know what to do or when to begin making a difference. The environment is made up of the the air we breathe, the soil we live on, uh, the trees that provide us with oxygen and animals on the planet, uh, uh, such as a nurturing environment, it would have been uh, impossible to exist on Earth. Uh, Human population growth, uh, the greatest significant expansion in human population history happened in later in half of the 20th century. The, uh, the 20th century um, and continues until the early 21st century according to 2020 world population data sheet, the global populations is expected to rise from 7.8 billion to, in 2020 to 9.9 .9 billion by 2050. This level effect, uh, effects, uh, reflects a greater than 25% increases over 2020, to, over 2020. The impact of so many people on natural resources and ecological system is a significant problem. In some Respects on human populations expanding is the underlying uh, environment environmental concern. Every year we add around 75 million uh, extra people to the planet, and this should be an awareness to the people that each day we are getting bigger and bigger. History of conservations and environmentalism. Many of our current beliefs that our environment and its sources have been expressed by writers and intellectuals during the last 150 years. Also, many past cultures had detrimental effects on the environments. Contemporary technological advances have considerable uh, improved our outcomes. As an example, uh, as a result of uh, these changes, new ways to understanding and safeguarding our environment have emerged. And they have at least four uh, distinct stages of history in environmental activism, and these are the uh, pragmatic unity, unitarian conservations which is according to uh, Jefford Penchot that I believe that sources should be used is for the should be used for the greatest good for the greatest number for the longest time.
and the second is the moral uh, moral and aesthetic na nature preservations and the third is growing concerns about the health and ecological ecological damage caused by pollutions and global environmental citizenship the least official surrounding our environment go on but there are three major major ones that affect the majority of them overall global warming and climate change water populations and ocean acidifications and loss of biodiversity these three issues need immediate attention and proactive actions on our part to ensure the conservation of the only habitat planet which we call our home uh, human activities have, have have made a global warming and climate change a global threat. The rising greenhouses uh, have caused an in, increase in average of global temperatures, extreme weather events, and other negative changes up until uh, now. Our environment still suffered and the reason is us. This is our home. We need to protect it as much as we can. Environment. It, it's a place where different things such as a wet or hot environment, it can be living abiotic and non-living, which is abiotic community, which includes three essential forces physical, uh, chemical, and natural. Environment also defines as the condition that surrounds uh, an organism or a group of organisms, uh, creatures, and moreover, the environment includes uh, everything living and non-living, which is bi biotic and abiotic. And also, um, Environmental science is an interdisciplinary academic field in science that integrates all physical, biological information in the study of environment and solutions to environmental problems. Okay, when we say environmental science, uh, it provides an overview of, uh, of how science affects our environment and an area of of biology concerned with the interaction between organism and the surrounding. Also, science defines the systemized body of knowledge that builds and organizes a lot of information in a dif in a different form of, of testable experiments and predictions about everything in the universe. Science also generates solutions for our everyday life uh, helps us to answer the great mysteries of the universe. Ecology, ecology is a branch of biology concerning interaction, interactions uh, and uh, physical, physical environment in both biotic and abiotic opponents. Okay, uh, when we say ecology, um, we already knew that it is the study of relationship uh, between planets, animals, uh, environment, people, and many more. Sustainability, the ability of a system to exist continually at a cost in a universe that involves in a state of entropy toward the thermal thermodynamic equilibrium of the planet. Uh, when also, uh, when we say sustainability, uh, it's all about the small changes we can make to help look after the planet and improve the quality of our lives and to protect our ecosystems and preserve our uh, natural resources. Habitat, uh, it's considered an environment is naturally occurring to specific organisms to survive. Mm, habitat is a place 
of an organism makes its uh, a home uh, the surrounding where plants and animals live is called the habitat. Metabolism. Uh, metabolism is a whole process of digi digesting the food intake of organisms. It is commonly known for breaking down uh, transportations of substances throughout human body cells. Uh, when we metabolism is a chemical and is also a chemical process on continuously uh, inside our body inside our body that allow life and normal functioning cell cell is considered as a basic unit of all living organisms both planets and animals the, the study of life is biology, pathology is for the study of cells, cytology is a study of, study for the cells. Cells can be unicellular, uh, having one cell organism or, or multicellular. Uh, when we say cell, mm, all of us know what is cells. Right? So when we say cells, an example of cells is a unit in the tissues tissue of an animal's muscles. And also a human body, a human body is composed of trillions of cells, uh, all, all with their own specialized. Atom is considered as the smallest particle of each element. Elements can be found in solid, liquid, gas, plasma, or Bush, Einstein. Considate each composed of the atom. Uh, when we say atom, it's also uh, the smallest unit of the element uh, in, any, in every solid, as, as I said, in every solid, liquid, gas, and plasma and many more and and moreover atom also known as uh, the basic building block for all the matter in the universe acids are the solutions having a ph which is power of hydrogen below it can donate protons are capable of forming covalent bond using an electron pairing Acids, it's also a chemical compound that uh, includes hydrogen and can combine with other uh, substance to generate salts. Enzymes uh, are considered as a catalyst. It would either speed up or lower down the chemical reactions without changing the compositions of substance. Uh, as and also are um, soluble, uh, uh, also a protein mo mu molecules uh, that have the ability to accelerate chemical process in cells. Example is a group of enzymes that helps digest fats in the gut. And also elements. Elements is a species of an atom having the same number of protons in its an atomic nuclei. nuclei. Elements all are also tiny particles that make up matter and a chemical made up for only one kind of atom is called an element. And that's it and thank you.